What it do, what it brew, this Mac man reporting live from the Watchmen's Hive. Coming with the T so you can see, so you ain't caught with your pants down. Look at this, it's here, y'all. D.C. Mayor to require vaccination papers for citizens leaving home starting on January 15th. Uh-oh, it's here. So I'm going to read this article real quick. D.C. Mayor to require vaccination papers for citizens leaving home starting on January 15th. Starting January 15th, D.C. residents will have to make sure that they have their vaccine passports before leaving home, according to D.C. Mayor Mary Bowser. Starting this weekend, many businesses will completely off limits to anyone caught without their vaccination papers. This includes bars, restaurants, gyms, nightclubs, and most indoor entertainment facilities. According to Bowser, before leaving your home, you must be sure to grab three things. Proof of vaccination, a photo ID, and a mask. Uh-uh. The actions of Mayor Bowser have set off a heated debate on social media with many claiming this to be a major infringement upon the rights of D.C. A list of places in D.C. where vaccine card and photo ID will be needed starting Saturday. Then it just lists like, you know, the bars and the nightclubs and the gyms and pretty much everything. Like you, you need a vaccination card to, to maneuver through here pretty much. Um, I'm actually in Alexandria, Virginia, which is right outside of Washington, D.C. I'm literally like seven minutes across this bridge. Uh, it's only a matter of time before it's here. It's only a matter of time before it's in Maryland. It's only a matter of time before it's 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 where you are. Like it's gonna be a wide worldwide thing, man. And I mean, it can be at your door just like that. And if you plan to, you know, be a you know a pure blood or whatever, like what are you gonna do? What's your plan? How are you gonna prepare? Like just like that, it can be at your door, man. And I mean, you won't be able to buy to sell. Any of that. That sounds like the Mark of the Beast talk to me. Like, you can't go here. You can't do this without this or that. Like, it's Mark of the Beast talk, man. And that's crazy because now that when food is bare, like, you, you, you. <laughs> when shelves are bare, now you want to make mandates that people can't go in restaurants if they are quote unquote un, you know, veed or whatever. Like, that's crazy, man. That's crazy. So anyway, man. So if you stay unvaxxed, like, what's your plan? What are you gonna do? You know what I'm saying? You can't buy. You can't sell. You can't go in in stores. You can't do anything. Like you're out back. I hope you have a plan. I hope you've been stacking up. I hope you're paying attention to these these shelves and stuff um that are bare. Like I hope that you're stacking up. Like I hope that you're smart, man. And taking the necessary steps to preserve you and or your family, man. There's a scripture that says a wise man foresees evil and, and hides himself, meaning meaning he sees what's coming and he does the necessary, he makes the necessary provisions and things that he needs to preserve himself and or his family. There's another scripture that talks about the ant uh, saying, look at the ant. See how she gathers her meat in the summer. You know what I'm saying? How long are you gonna be a slugger? Better get it while it's while the getting is good. Prepare, have a plan, stack up. You see what's coming. It's not a game. It's about to get real out here, and it's gonna get real, real, real fast. So have a plan. Pray. Have faith. Prepare.